Hey everyone. So here's what's happening. Uh, back in 2023, another helicopter, like the one that flew into the Hudson River and crashed into it um, just a day ago, crashed in the exact same way with uh, the tail section coming off and the, the main rotors coming off with the transmission attached uh, after a bird strike. So it was hit by a, an eagle in Australia in 2023. It was the Bell 206L. It was an earlier version of the one that crashed into the Hudson, but it hit an eagle um, at pretty low altitude. Um, the Australian Transportation Safety Board ruled that the pilot was most likely startled. He he abruptly uh, did something onto the controls, which caused the uh, main rotor to do something like a, uh, a mast bump. The risk of excessive flapping and possible mast bumping increases when you allow the aircraft to approach low G conditions. The rotor hub strikes the mast violently on one side, Than the other, and the mast may separate. So, in the same situation where you get that mast bump and uh, where the mast detaches, uh, in this case, the mast will not detach according to the FAA. It can also cause the main rotor to tilt enough where it hits the tail section, which is what happened in the Australia crash, uh, according to their authorities. It sliced through the tail section, it came off, and then the main part of the helicopter kept falling, and then that's when the, uh, the main rotors with the transmission came off. And I believe that looks like is what happened in the Hudson River uh, helicopter crash. Now this is new footage that came out that shows the helicopter breaking up and you can see uh, what looks like the tail section coming off after it was sliced by the main rotor. Then the main rotor coming off and the fuselage uh, main part uh, continuing to fall as everything else does. It also should be noted that the Bell 206's replacement, the Bell 407, had a tail uh, detachment problem um, in Hawaii 2022. That uh, Bell 407 crashed, the, the tail actually separated from it and crashed um, onto uh, one of the islands there. That's unknown to have a problem with the, uh, the prior um, 206's, but you just have to note that there is that problem. They've had it once and they had to tell everybody, you know, go back and check your tail sections uh, for correct torque and stuff like that. 